Oh, hello, man. How are you doing? Uh, I think it's gonna drop and it's gonna hit something. Uh, guys? Are you listening to me? Oh, great googly moogly, this is creepy. What's up, everyone? This is me, Sean, and today I am back in Subnautica, and yeah, today I'm going to be actually building the Seamoth. And uh, yeah, I have gone around and I have collected all the pieces of the Seamoth that I need, and I have also gathered all the fragments to the mobile vehicle bay, and now we can make, well, the mobile vehicle bay, and after that we can make, um, the whatever the sea moth that's what it's called okay so i'm gonna journey back a little bit more towards wilson just because there's a there's a guy out here that i do not want to deal with every time i get up in my mobile vehicle bay uh but yeah let's go ahead and let's place it down Splodoosh. there we go look at him look at him go all right let's climb up onto it and uh, we have a little lag but it's okay all right now we have all these awesome little dudes over here Got a couple little, like, helicopter things coming out the sides. It's really cool, man. Alright, uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and let's see what we can craft. So right now, we can craft the sea moth. Now we need, oh, we need titanium ingots. Or a, a titanium ingot. We need a power cell, glass, uh, times two, and lubricant. So, uh, yeah, that's all easy enough to get. So, let me see again, uh, power cell is probably going to be the uh, worst. And even that's not that bad, so... Yeah, um, where is my base? My base is right there. And yeah, so, I need, let's see, I need four glass. I need ten titanium. And, whoa! Okay, uh, let's go try to find some, uh, quartz. Not glass, I meant quartz. Uh, but yeah, let's try to find us some quartz, and hopefully, it's somewhere around here. Um, aha! We got some quartz down there, uh, so let's go grab that. Uh, oh, I'm gonna run out of power here soon, that's gonna be amazing. Quartz, and quartz, and quartz, and okay, creepy sounds, but yeah, I'm just going to keep going over here, and I'm going to grab a couple things for lubricant. Oh, please don't, please don't, you don't have to nibble on me, please. Alright, so I'm going to grab some things from here. Alright, let's just grab a couple creep vine seed clusters. Alright. Go up to the surface, because I'm going to need air. And I'm also a little bit discombobulated, and I don't know where the heck I am. So, Wilson's off that way. Alright, so I'm actually not that far from my base base. So, I'm pretty sure my base is, like, right over there. I got everything for the lubricant. I got everything for, uh, everything else. But, um, yeah. I just saw the life pod down here. I'm going to go check it out real quick. Where was it? It was right there. Okay. Oh. He don't look too happy. Uh, okay, well. When I get something to combat you, I will actually go down there. But for right now, I'm not going to do that. Uh, because that would be stupid. You? Can you give me copper? Uh, yes, you get. You can give me copper. That's very nice. Is it also turning dark? Or is it that uh, eclipse thing that's going to happen again? Oh, hello, man. How are you doing? I'm not doing too well right now. Uh, myself, because you know you're, you're there. Okay. <laughs> Let's just uh, keep him out there for now. And, uh, yeah. Uh, no eclipse. Maybe there's an eclipse. Is there? It's getting darker. And it's not supposed to be getting darker. So it's it's just kind of messing with my head. Alright, let's get some lubricant. Let's get some glass. Alright, we need two pieces of glass. There we go. And that is two pieces of glass. Alright, now we can make the titanium ingot. That's a lot of titanium that goes into that. And uh, we, we also need to build a power cell. Um, battery. Power cells. Two batteries and silicone. Silicon, not silicone. Silicon rubber. Alright, so that's two batteries right there. And now we need silicon rubber, which is made from these guys, I think. I think I need three of you for silicon rubber. So that's, uh, whoa. Okay, let's craft some rubber. And it takes two. Warning. Emergency power only. 
Oh! Well, ain't this just lovely? Alright, let's make our way back to Wilson in the creepiness of night. With nothing but my own two hands. There's music in the background, and everything is bioluminescing. Help me. Alright, now we're back in Wilson. Jeez. Oh, man. Oh, wait, what? We have a message. Oh, I'm gonna play that. Wait! Wait, what? Okay. Wait, what? What? What is this? This is Second Officer King broadcasting to all surviving Aurora crew. Captain Hollister is gone. I have assumed command the computer... The computer has identified dry land approximately 750 meters south of the crash site. Your orders are to stay together, ensure your immediate safety, and then regroup at the attached coordinates. Oh my goodness. Alright, so instead of going to the Aurora, you can just get those messages instead? I thought you had to go to the Aurora to get that stuff. Um, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, do I have any markers now? Do I, ha I don't have any markers. Okay. Nor do I know which way is south and which way isn't. Okay. Um, I don't know if that's fully implemented yet. Uh, but it, it, it's cool. It's very cool. Also, I'm pretty sure that, uh, that life pod I saw earlier, that was at the bottom of the ocean, yeah, I'm pretty sure that was 17. So, uh, I don't think I need to answer that distress call. Oh, right, guys. Well, I am back up here, and it is daytime. So, yeah, um, I did actually, like, craft everything that I needed to have for the sea moth, uh, but I haven't crafted the sea moth yet. So, yeah, let's go ahead. Let's go over to the mobile vehicle bay thingy, which is right there, and let us hope uh, that, you know, everything will be all right over by there. I'm pretty sure it's in the same spot, though. Uh, but yeah, uh, keyboard, can you please work? Thank you. Alright. I really need a non-Bluetooth uh, keyboard for my computer. Oh man, it's getting like real bad. Alright, hey guys, how you doing? You guys seem to be doing great. Alright, so, you guys, go craft me a Seamoth. Right now. Go do it. Oh man, that doesn't seem like the best place to do it. Uh, I think it's gonna drop and it's gonna hit something. Uh, guys? Are you listening to me? Uh, no, they're not. Uh, but this is this is going to be just amazing anyway. So yeah. Oh boy, that is laggy when I look at you. Okay. Hello. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Is it sea myth? Wait, wait, wait. I know, I know. You can breach and you can like fly. Oh, that's sick. All right. Well, I know immediately what I'm going to do with you. I'm going to go say hi to the Reefbacks. Because Reefbacks are amazing. And, uh, also, I did see, like, a drop down to what I believe is the Jelly Shroom Caves. Uh, so let's go ahead, let's find that. Ooh, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, game, just, just calm yourself, okay? Calm yourself, come on. All right, jeez. The game doesn't like me. All right, hello, buddy. How you- Oh, no, we don't want you. How you doing, man? You doing swell? Alright, so... Oh, boy. We're gonna go down here. Oh, uh, no, the Cheshire Catfish are gonna come after me if I come down here. Oh, my gosh, guys. What? Wait, this isn't the Jelly Shrooms. Wait. This isn't the Jelly Shrooms. Is it? Oh, it is. Oh, great googly moogly. This is creepy. Oh, 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 hold up. Okay, hold on. Someone's knocking on my door. This is not spooky at all, huh? Oh my gosh, it goes so deep. It goes so deep. I know like. I know like. I know likey this way. This way, this way I know likey. Okay. So... Let's go out here. Let's explore and see what's like out here beyond. 
or in the beyond. What is that? That was a fish. All right, fish. R.I.P. Fish. All right. Let's see where we are in conjunction with uh, everything else. All right. So there's Wilson, and all right. So that is how close to the thing I am. All right. Hello, Reef. Back. I'm gonna dive down here to you. I'm gonna try coming over this way a little bit more, just so that uh, I get a little bit further away from the Aurora, and then we can see what's out here. Oh goodness gracious! Stop scaring me, rocks! It's not worth being scared of you. It's not worth it, man. All right. What is out here? Whoa! Oh, hi! He is coming after me. These Cheshire Cat guys are actually really creepy. All right. What's out here, man? I want to know. Show me your secrets, oh game. Besides those things. Those things are not secrets. They are just weird and they are creeping me out because it's just something moving on the screen. And I don't like stuff moving on the screen. Oh, this is flat. Oh, hi, man. This is just the same biome. Copy and pasted. Oh. Oh. Oh, you're chasing me still. Please don't. Please don't chase me. Ooh. Oh, man. That's the same jelly shroom place. All right. So. <sighs> Do your stupid little roar. Dive down again. Oh, I hate diving down. Oh, it's so creepy. Okay. Oh, man. This game is amazing and terrifying at the exact same time I like it <laughs> it is actually very very creepy and terrifying right now because there's so much stuff that I don't know about and I know this is the exact same hole I just went down but I want to go back down it oh don't bump your head please that would not be a good thing that I would want you to do okay can I go down? Okay. Okay, so the crush depth is 200, I think. I'm just gonna take a gander at this place real quick. Whoa! Oh, there's... I know there's a crab guy over there. Yeah, see? You see that guy over there? You don't ever want to go near those. Because they're gonna jump out at you and scare the living pants off of you. Oh, there's another one over there. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so creepy and awesome at the exact same time. I don't know how to feel about it. All right. All right, I'm getting out of here. Oh, goodness gracious. It's so creepy. All right, guys. Well, I know I've been staying away from the Aurora. And that is because I really don't want to get in totally and utterly destroyed by a, a Reaper Leviathan. I almost said a Creeper Leviathan. Uh, but I do know those Reaper Leviathans are over there. <sighs> I get, but against my better judgment, I'm going to go take a gander over there. I'm not going to go into the ship yet, because I know I'm not ready for that. But I'm going to see what's over there. Okay, again, oh, wait, what? He totally clipped through the world there. All right, so... Oh, boys, this is not going to be pleasant. All right, I... Oh. Boys, I don't know if I can do this right now. Tisk tisk. Oh, you hear that music? That music means bad things. Oh, uh, radiation. Okay, um, probably shouldn't go there. Okay, I totally forgot about the radiation. Uh, so, it gives me an excuse not to go over there now. Okay, that's great. Okay. We're at 90%. What should we do with the Seamoth? I mean, I know... Oh, jeez. Alright. I know I totally went uh, exploring um, with the Seamoth down to the Jelly Shrooms. But what I think I should do is I think I should try to go find that landmass. Or I should add on to my base, which is right over here. Ooh, which one should I do? I am so excited and I am so terrified at the exact same time right now. I don't know which one is better or which one's better, which one's worse. I don't know. 
I really don't want to. And at the same time, I really do. You know? You know what I mean, guys? Alright, so air sec! Come to me! Nope. Oh, hi! There's a lot of you guys. Oh, yeah. There's definitely a lot of you guys. Ooh, there's a Hoover fish. Hello, Hoover fish. Um, I would get you, but you don't really, um, give me anything I need. And that's a mobile vehicle bay fragment, and I don't need you. All right. What should I get? Where is, where are all the air sacs? I almost said, what should I get? But no, I need the air sacs. Where are they? Ah, oh, there's one. Hello. Hey, buddy. All right, there we go. Got you. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha. Hello, other air sack that is going to be caught by me. You are you are going to be a great drink of water for me. All right. Hello. Uh, we, we need to give him a name, guys. Put in the comment section down below what we should give him, or what name we should give him, because I feel like if he's going to be out there, he needs a name. Oh, goodness. He's sitting right outside my base. I don't feel safe anymore, guys. I don't feel safe. Alright. <laughs> He's like camping outside my base. It's just, it's so rude, man. You shouldn't do that, alright? Alright, so, I'm going to see what I can make. Can I make anything? I can make a corridor. I can make a foundation. I can make an L corridor. I can make a T corridor. I can make an X corridor. I can make a window. Oh, I can't make a window. I can make a... No, I can't do that either. Um, I can make a ladder, because that's going to be very useful here, right? I can't make you. I need one more titanium for you. And I cannot make an alien containment unit, because I don't have any glass. Yay! So, um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pause the video uh, right now. And I will see you guys in a second. Hold on! Alright, guys. Well, um... I'm gonna go ahead, I'm just gonna get going for today. I know that I really didn't do much today, but I have basically run out of time to record this. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna have to get going for today. And yeah, um, hope you guys did enjoy this video. And uh, in between uh, this episode and the next episode, I will work on my base a little bit. And uh, yeah, I will show it to you guys when I get back for the next video, uh, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, smack that like button with your forehead. I don't know what else to say because there's a lot of other things that you could you could do with a like button. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next video.